we found the semi-autonomous functions to be a few steps short of perfection, with the Maybox slowing down too drastically for turns. Furthermore, the active steering system had a tendency to ping-pong the car back and forth across the lane on all but the straightest of roads. We did appreciate the upgraded lane change assist system, which now allows the Maybach to automatically change lanes with a simple tap of the turn signal stop. Turn off the self-driving features, though, and the Maybach drives with the stoic confidence synonymous with the three-pointed star. As before, the steering is perfectly tuned to the intended mission, it s light and creamy at low speeds, but quickly and seamlessly adds weight and feedback as speeds climb. Likewise, the cushy air spring suspension delivers first-class refinement over road imperfections while avoiding excessive body roll through turns or pronounced dive during heavy braking. Rolling on a set of staggered, 20-inch Goodyear Eagle F1A symmetric two-run flat summer tires. The 5,143-pound S564 Matic circled our skid pad with a Mazda Miata besting 0.91 grams of grip. It also managed to stop from 70 miles per hour in a fade-free 163 feet, and its firm and reassuring brake pedal would feel at home in a sports car. In place of the previous steering column mounted cruise control stock, the 2018 S-Class moves all cruise control functions to the steering wheel. Engaging the adaptive cruise control system reveals myriad changes, including